Alright, folks. This is a first for me. Well, first for the commentary channel. This is a glider. We're breaking several boundaries in 2013. Helicopters? Gliders? Oh, wait, I didn't upload that one. <laughs> oh, yeah, I did the Huey. That's right. <laughs> anyway, well, this is the Waco glider from World War II. Basically, this was a DC 3 tow plane. I believe you can change the tow plane. I'll have to talk to Austin about changing the tow plane. We are now hooked up to a tow plane, and we're going to go up to about 2,000 feet. We're going to do two tows. Gonna have to tow us around the airfield twice, and I have changed it where I have two commentary days, Saturday and Sunday. Got a bit of a crosswind, that's why the, air, the glider start to go the other direction there. We're going to get airborne pretty soon here. See, we're airborne, but he's got to gain a little more speed. There's your release level right there. We're currently at 300, 400. Mm, hold on, folks. Let me see. Yeah, KZPH back here. I don't know, guys. May do commentaries here. I don't know. I think it's better to do commentaries here. The area is known for the comment. outside the airplane right now. Yeah, you know, this is a, this comes with the just flight DC three, which which is kind of nice, but I, I kinda prefer the glider more than the DC three. <laughs> Alright. Alright, we're gonna climb up the rest of our two thousand feet. And detach cable. Ready to release light on. That, that plane is no longer towing us. We are on our own airspeed now. It is up to us to get back to the airfield and or glide around in circles to gain on thermals. Which since, uh... Alright folks, we'll try. Let me just do something. Display in general. Um... No, I'm looking for the one that you guys will see in a minute. Reels and settings. Uh, no, it's not it. Where's it? Where do they, where do they keep them setting at? Sound display. Maybe it's a display. Oh wait, wait. Is there something in flight settings? Flight analysis. Let's look at this. Uh, no. More, it may be in display. Let me look. Anthroscopic scenery weather. All right, I think it's supposed to display thermals now if they're existent. Apparently, there's none existent here. Anyway, we're gonna make a beeline back for that for runway 22. That should run my 1A. Let's see if we'll make it. We got the airspeed, we got the altitude, we're about a thousand. Three hundred. Let's announce our position. Kilo Zulu Papa Hotel Traffic Waco November 874 Golf Lima is on final runway one eight. To land. No, it's a 
you guys, after I get done, I'm just gonna probably get this thing going in the air some more, just more glider flights while the video's rendering, possibly. Either that or just, uh, sit and watch a movie. Alright, there's the runway. No, this does have speed brakes, see? A little bit. It's just straight right over. Speed brakes are currently deployed. Let's, let's lower them. Pretty good frame rate right now, folks, so. As of right now, we could lose all of our airspeed and we could still make it. We have the altitude, we have the airspeed. Too much airspeed. Just bleed off that airspeed. Look, we can land right on the line. Every time you hear the airframe losing the air, the wind around the airframe slowing, that means I've deployed the speed brakes. Folks, let's get another glider tow. We'll do another one more glider tow, and we'll come in for one, one four, or four. All right, let's let the uh, mall there get to. Interesting story today. Yes, I am. My dad went flying, took our jet up, right? Coming in to fuel up, right? And this glider plane is coming right at us, right? You think, oh, well, you just pull out of the way and he simply doesn't hit you, right? Wrong. He had a 50 foot cable attached to that plane and he came within f 5 feet of our airplane. My father had not dived would have been in the ground dead because it would have clipped through our wing and would have destroyed the wing and we would have crashed. True story here guys, I'm not kidding. Alright, let's see Maul Orion. 500. It, it'll take us a little ways out from the airfield so we'll swing back in around. There's your 1,000 feet. I gotta say, this is a nice glider. Where that mall has a degree of flaps in the whole time we're getting towed up into the air. Look at the look that guy's giving me. I think I should go back there and slap him. And you can break the tow cable if you do it incorrectly. You will and Cannon will break the tow cable. Alright, let's get the uh, that altitude. Release. And pull away, turn around, and head back towards the airport because you're not gliding. Six, we may come in another runway here. We're coming in at one two zero, so we'll, we'll make it in three six most likely. Kilo Santa Papa Hotel traffic Waco November eight seven four Golf Lima is on final runway three six to land. Alright guys. This is going to be the first of new glider 
commentaries, new reviews on the gliders. I want you guys suggesting me these gliders because I'm not going to go out and look for gliders because I don't know what to look for in gliders. You should know a whole server full of glider maniacs. Anyways, guys, we're about to land successfully yet again. We could probably go up higher, but I, just, I don't feel comfortable leaving the airspace yet. Let's put her down on the runway, get her pulled off the runway and stop. We're getting about 20 frames per second, guys. It's not half bad. We'll taxi off the runway right now so we don't protect any landing aircraft. Mm. There you go guys, the Waco World War II glider. It's a beautiful bird. Comes with the Just Flight DC-3. I think Just Flight may be selling it separately. Go ahead, buy the DC-3 for it. It's worth it. It's beautiful. Remember, guys, I won't do gliders unless you suggest a glider. Leave a link in the in the comments for a glider.